Don't you hate this? In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to hit chip shots from a horrible lie. Let's do it. Ugh. So if you're new to the channel, I do a lot of golf tip and drill videos. So hit the subscribe button and the bell notification so you don't miss anything. Today we're talking about how to hit chip shots off a horrible lie, kind of like that. Nobody likes those. So I'm gonna show you a cool little way to pull that off. Let me show you how to do that right now. So the first thing you want to do to be able to pull this shot off is grab your wedge that has the least amount of bounce. So this is my 60 degree wedge. It has four degrees of bounce. So typically I will use a 60 degree wedge with very little bounce when I play courses that have conditions that are very hard packed sand or the ground could be, you're gonna get a lot of uh, bare hard pack lies. So when it's soft and squishy, I might go with the higher bounce. When it's hard packed, I'll go with the very low bounce. And my setup of wedges will also have different bounces for each wedge so that even if I'm playing in a soggy condition, I get a hard pack lie, I'll have a wedge with very little bounce in my bag at all times. And I'll have a wedge with high bounce in my bag at all times as well. Uh, it's just something I do, something to think about. For this shot, I want you to grab your wedge with the least amount of bounce because a couple reasons, even if it's a 50 degree wedge, if it has the lowest amount of bounce, I would use that. The reason why is you don't want the bounce hitting the ground in a hard packed junky lie conditions. And typically the least amount of bounce will get the ball the highest. That's step one. Oh, okay, here's step two. Very important. When you have a lie similar to this, any type of rough lie, the tendency is you want to, you think you want to hit the ball high. So you need to open the club face. Fatal mistake. Opening the face is adding bounce to the bottom of the club. We don't want to add bounce. Although I have four degrees of bounce on this club, I don't want any more than that. As a matter of fact, I want less than that. So instead of opening the face, I'm going to shut it. So if opening adds bounce, shutting it takes away bounce. So I'm going from four degrees of bounce to maybe two or zero. I want no bounce. Now, yeah, the ball is gonna come out lower now, but I'd rather have a low shot on the green than a high shot two feet in front of me. So, step two, shut down the face. The ball will go more left, so you're gonna to have to adjust with your aim, but that's fine. The goal is putt. Your next, your next shot should be a putt. That's your goal. So shut that face, okay? Very, very important. Least amount of bounce, shut the face. Step three, let's go. Okay, here is uh, step three. You're shutting the face. I want my feet close together. You do wanna back the ball up in your stance a little bit in this particular instance, okay? Here's center. Just a little bit, maybe a, a half a ball. And I'm shutting that face down right here. That's step three. And now you're good to go. Now, all the other fundamentals are the same. Back and through with rotation. Shut the face, rotate. We don't wanna start getting too complicated with a whole bunch of other swing thoughts. It's really all set up. It's club choice and set up. That's all we have to do. Back that ball up a touch, and then you're good to go. What I like to do for practice is just get a bunch of balls, throw them around the junky parts of my yard, which is easy to find here, and then just start chipping with that same technique, practicing from horrible eyes. Remember, low bounce, shut the face, 
back it up just a touch, everything else remains the same. Rotate through the shot like any other normal chip shot. If there's another piece of advice I would give you, it would apply for every shot you ever play in golf, is always accelerate through the ball. A lot, you hear that all the time. But in these situations, it's more critical than any other. You have to accelerate through the ball. So there you go, that's the shot. We're shutting the face, we're aiming left, we're taking very little bounce on the bottom of the club so that we can get through that tough, hard pack lie. Let me know what you think, give it a shot, hit that like button, comment below, let me know how it's working for you. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Thanks for watching, I love you guys. We'll see you in the next video.